Hey guys, Thornton here. Welcome back to new vlog. Now today, I'm going to be going to a Europa League match tonight. It's going to be Arsenal versus AC Milan. Obviously, it's already been the first leg and Arsenal won that 2-0. It's interesting. Recently, Arsenal have been playing really well. They, they beat Watford, they beat AC Milan, but before that, they had a very bad record. And especially at the Emirates. And attendances have been very low. People have been boycotting the stadium because of Wenger. And it's going to be interesting to see the attendance tonight and the full-time result. In my opinion, Arsenal 2-0 up. They're going to be a bit settled. I'm going to go with a 1-1 draw. Now, if you don't know, AC Milan's team is very weak. I mean, they've got an ex-Blackburn Croatian striker. They've got Barini, who got relegated with Sunderland. They've got Suso, who got released from Liverpool in, like, 2014. It's not strong at all. And then you look at, uh, obviously, Arsenal team. It's strong. You look at it, you cannot say it's a bad team. So if you compare the team, Arsenal are at home. Arsenal... Honestly, they could go out there and do really well. I'm just saying they could go out there and win 2 or 3-0, and I'll give them that. They would be a really good performance, but we don't know. As a neutral, I just hope there are going to be a lot of goals. Uh, my prediction disagrees with that, but we'll see what happens. All right, Dog Dad, you're not coming with me yeah, today. I'm not. But it would be rude not to get your match prediction. What's going to happen? Well, yeah, I'm not coming because I'm playing football myself tonight. Oh, okay. Um, Arsenal won the first leg 2-0, and tonight's going to be job done. I think they'll score at least twice. I'm going to go for 2 0 again. 2 0 again? Who's yeah. going to score? Um, I think Ozil is going to get one of them. Really? Yes, yeah. And if I could pronounce the striker's name, I'd say he gets the other one. A boomerang, yeah? A yeah, boomerang. That's the one, yeah. yeah. Mm. You know, a boomerang, did he get a touch today? I can't mm. remember. Mm. You know, a boomerang, 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 a boomerang. It's not fucking good enough! It's not good enough! So you AC Milan fan, right? Yeah, I'm AC Milan fan. And uh, you're from there, you're from Italy, you come over on the plane? Yeah, I went from Turin. Okay. Live here, yeah. Oh, you live there, yeah. yeah? Cool. So do you go to the home games at AC Milan? Yes, of course. And uh, what, what should we expect for the away fans today? Are, are they loud? I don't know. I don't, I don't really know because, you know, we are at 2,000 people. Yeah. Yeah, and you are 5,000. 5, yeah, yeah. 5, yeah. 5, yeah. True. Yeah, so a lot outnumbered people. Do they sing? Are they loud? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Very loud. And does this game mean a lot to you? Because obviously you went, you lost 2-0 in the first leg. Yeah. And in the Serie A you're only 7th. So are you really going to go for it today? Yeah, maybe. Or maybe they just leave it and yeah. concentrate for the championship. Yeah. And yeah, championship, you'd say. Yeah. And who's, which player should we look out for today? Player? Yeah, in, in the Milan side. I don't know, maybe Bonucci. Bonucci, maybe, yeah. I heard about him. He's not had this kind of season you expected, though. This yeah, year. yeah. You, maybe he's not really gelled into the side. Yeah, maybe. Maybe because when he played for Juventus, he yeah. played with Mandali, Kilini, yeah. so. All the best players. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But yeah, no, thank you very much. What's your name? Lorenzo. Oh, Lorenzo, thank you very much for your advice. Enjoy the game. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Love that. Brilliant. Listen. Yeah, he lives in Turin. You cannot yeah. tell anyone uh, that he's an AC Milan fan. Like, uh, <laughs> yeah. like they'll come after him. It's true. <laughs> holy fuck! Holy fuck! Holy! Yeah, yeah. no, Love that! Brilliant. Oh. You got your no alcohol song. Celebrate with daddy. Come on. Yes. Love that. Great. I don't see Nicky Hunt in the program. Are you sure we're at the right game? Oh, they might have. Oh, they made a mistake. You might have to send the copy back. Club level pizza. What is it good? What is it good? Should play up front. You should play up front. Okay. Club level pizza. What's your verdict? Mm. This pizza should play up front. Yeah. Absolutely. No. All day long. It's good. All day long. Good texture. Definitely could do a job up front. No 
Very loud AC Milan fans down there. Pretty good. All right, Altai, start off. Firstly, thank you very much for the tickets. So, uh, appreciate that. And um, what... I know, I know. I mean, we've seen, we've seen the team sheets and uh, it's a disappointing time right now. No Nick has won. But... Yeah. I was totally expecting him to play up front. That's why I got the... Yeah, that's why you got the tickets in the first place. So I think it's going to be a tight game. Yeah. Arsenal will score early and kill the game off. You think? So it'll be a KG 1-0. Fair Both enough. Will probably get the assist. Well, what, what, if Nicky Hunt was playing, what would your prediction be like? Oh, it's still 1-0. <laughs> Ozil will get the assist. Yeah, yeah, fair Nicky enough. But he would score, yeah, obviously. It's only been a minute and AC Milan have nearly scored. And by the way, their fans are just incredible. It is pretty impressive so far. This game can go either way. Um, I know I've said a 1 1 prediction, but if AC Milan score early, I think there could be a lot of goals in this game. Here come Arsenal on the break. Will they do anything with it? That is the question. Jack Wilshire. Jack Wilshire, will he sign a new contract? That's another discussion. Ozil on the ball. AC Milan. That's where the screams coming from. Bad ball from Bellerin. Goes to Vicatarian. Good touch though. Will he shoot? Ah. Oh. Vicatarian here. Oh. Arsenal, they've been the better team so far. There's only about 24 minutes left in this half. Arsenal look like they're going for it, but if AC Milan can see it, the game's over. It's as simple as that. No one in this Arsenal side wants to shoot. Now then, it's 1-0 to AC Milan just before half time. If that was a perfect time to score, it would be now. Now the AC Milan fans are loud. It is crazy. Who to AC Milan get one or two more goals and get back into this game? This could be interesting. It only takes one to go to extra time. But Arsenal on the break here. Shout Wilshire. Ozil. Great save. Donna Rummer. Brilliant save. Oh! Oh wow! Penalties given! Penalties given! And Arsenal have got a penalty kick! Now AC Milan were literally winning for two minutes! And now they can concede and it could be 1-1! One, one. This is incredible! It's not even half time! Welbeck went down, there was contact, they've earned a penalty kick! Seven minutes till half time. If Welbeck converts this penalty, it's going to be 1-1. One, one. Ah, this is a big, big loss. Bonucci having a go at the ref, but there's nothing you can do. The decision's been made. Donnarumma versus Welbeck. And it's a goal. And it's a goal. And it's a goal. Welbeck's done it. AC Milan fans, not happy with that at all. I hope AC Milan enjoyed that few minutes of the lead. It's 1-1 again. And it's about to go half time. This game's got very interesting in the in the, in the three much five minutes. <laughs> Thoughts on this out time? I told you there was gonna be goals. What is happening?
happening? And how did that not go in? Oh, AC <laughs> Milan fans confused. Well, Beck. And it's an extra time of the first half, and that could have sealed the game, but it's not gone in. What Gattuso needs to do with this AC Milan players is absolutely tell them at half time, go for it. You can score against this team, so just go for it in the second half, and AC Milan could, could get back into it. Crazy! Arsenal going for it again, he's gone down. Arsenal are really, really going for it. High pressure on them, and it's working. A few chances, not scored though. And there it is. Very entertaining game so far. Bring on the second half. Time for the second half. Rodriguez here. Oh, he should have done better. How have they missed that? And somehow that very bad shot has caused an injury. Yeah. Kalinic, ex Blackburn player, first touch of the day on his head. It's nearly a goal. And the ex Blackburn player has nearly brought AC Milan back in the game versus Arsenal. That's a headline and a half. Game on. Makes it 4-1, and that's game over. A Jack Boom outside of the box shot that eventually went into the net. Oh no. Donnarumma should have done better. AC Milan have started a chant, and the Arsenal have just adjusted it and started to Ospina. They've got a good chant going, it's been going for about 10 minutes, uh, but they're loving it. They're trying to enjoy their last few minutes here in, in London. But uh, yeah, the game's lost, but the fans are loud. Arsenal on the attack here. It's game over. It is game over. And they are absolutely loving it. Game over. Arsenal 3-1 and Arsenal 5-1 in aggregate. It's over here at the Emirates. Domination. I've got to say, AC Milan fans were great, but the players on the pitch did not have chemistry. They had individual quality, but not chemistry. They didn't play as a team that well. And Arsenal do, because they've played together for longer. It's been good. It's been a great game for a neutral. We've seen four goals. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching. Please like, comment down below how your team's doing recently. And uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. Let's have a discussion in the comments. I'll reply to a few of you. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the like button. And uh, yeah, from me and Altai, Nicky I Hunt. I told you there was going to be goals. Was a dream. From me and Altai, thank you guys for watching. And Nicky Hunt should play. Up front. See you guys.